going to do a series of quick videos as a tour for the creation murals at First United Methodist Church in Huntsville. And here is day one. This uh, represents the beginning and that which we normally see translated as when uh, in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. Uh, there's an alternate reading, and I've chosen the alternate reading. Uh, when God began to create the heavens and the earth is an alternate possibility for the way uh, the, the Hebrew could be translated. And I like that because it implies a continuity. So this is the beginning of a long and continuous process of creation in which we still live. But, in the mural we go from, we have a chaos and a great deep of mystery and God's breath blows across the face of this void and deep until we arrive at a point where there is a uh, separation of light and darkness. And then the establishment of a grand structure in which all things are. And uh, in doing this particular mural, I borrowed on uh, a couple of images that I really like. One is from the smallest structures in the brain, the, the synapses and dendrites and things like that, the connections that tie a brain together that I'm referencing with these things. And I'm also uh, referencing the very largest structures in the observable universe, the, these vast tendrils of matter in the midst of great emptiness in which there is uh, all of the matter that we know of, that we can experience ourselves, occurs in, in galaxies, and these galaxies are gathered in these thin little tendrils in the vastness of space. So we have a structure for the beginning of the universe and God will take this structure and extend it forward in the, in the days to come. 